today is basically like to vlog um and i did not get virtually any chores done this weekend like basically nothing got done this weekend um, we were just very busy and oh my god we went to an estate sale i got literally the most beautiful art and vases um i can't wait to show you guys i have some plans especially for this room um but nothing got done so I'm, gonna let, I'm talking like personal things I need to take care of and then just like house stuff. So it's a Monday. I'm just gonna make it like a CEO day. Like I'm just doing what I have to do to make sure that the rest of the week um, does not fall apart. And that I can kind of start to like, I made myself a really like intentional and in-depth schedule. And I want to like be able to really fall into the practice of that this week um so yeah <laughs> that's where we are i'm gonna eat my lunch um slash breakfast because i basically ate an orange and water so far today and get going on some more house stuff so. january 9th don't at me the christmas tree is still up Yes, the stockings are still hung by the fake fireplace with care. Um, laundry is all over the couch, Amazon boxes, storage containers are all around me. I was not exaggerating when I said this place was a disaster area. So, I'm going to focus my attention on the Christmas stuff first, I think, because I really want to get this tree out of here and I ordered um, like a tree storage bag so that should be helpful but so yeah it's a thing this place is a mess but I'm gonna put YouTube on the TV in the background and I'm just gonna take care of it um, I lollygagged so I should have been doing this like an hour ago two hours ago I got a little distracted but now we're gonna focus cuz I have no choice and this is driving nuts technology problems every single way I look okay so yesterday my camera kept dying and then I was having memory card problems so I couldn't finish like the end of like the vlog for yesterday I also like did not finish my chores so I'm not I'm only working till three today and then I'm gonna work on getting Christmas put away in this house because I cannot live like this any longer um, I just need like so much clutter. There's just like, I just can't. And then I've had problems with other memory cards and I'm just I feel like my computer's going really slow and my phone's like constantly dying. I, Mercury is in retrograde and like for real, my life is like it's in retrograde right now. But I 
had to do client work this morning so I, I got that done and I'm just I'm, like I said I'm just editing till three and then we gotta like just get this house situated because I can't function like this and I'm having a meeting here on Friday no on Thursday oh, in two days so I'm like freaking out a little bit but with that pushing that work off I, I think I just have to resolve myself to the fact that Saturday I'm going to have to do some things. But maybe that'll be better because my husband's home the next two days. And I find it really hard to work when he's home. Uh, because like he wants my attention and I also I want to hang out with him because his schedule is so weird. So it might just be e easier for me to work on Saturday because I know he's not... He's not gonna be here. That sounds so terrible, but it's, it's because I want to spend time with him, and like I have a hard time not spending time with him when he's here, because I like him. But yeah, I'm just I'm I'm like struggling. I'm struggling. <laughs> Today, I'm really trying to get my my calendar in order. There's so many things going on that I don't want to get overwhelmed, and I want to be like very intentional and like dedicated, because that's the word of the year, to like my my calendar this year, and like really like intentional on like when I'm doing these things, this is what I'm doing, because um, there's so much to do that like I don't really have the luxury of being like wishy-washy about like what i'm doing and like half in on things i had to fix the camera a little bit so i'm thinking of doing like block scheduling and just like each day like i take care of that specific area so i have like admin product development marketing and social media content creation and services slash consults um as like my areas so i think I'm, each day of the week is just going to be dedicated to those things that need to take place another thing is is like i'm like creating my schedule like i know myself so like with having this in mind and like i can create my schedule however i want to I know like Mondays, I need like a soft launch on a Monday. I need like flexibility. I need like the CEO, CEO day, like flexibility on Mondays. So I think I could do like an ad, I think admin, I have admin kind of now on my draft as like a Monday thing. I think Mondays are definitely admin days. And then Thursday and Friday, my husband typically works. Although his schedule lately has been a little wild. So I'm thinking, those are the better days to film. So that'll be like social media filming and YouTube filming and editing. Um, so then that gives like me time for like services, marketing and product development. Different days for that stuff. Just need to think, I just need to like digest and figure it out. <laughs> completed a to-do list all week like I just feel like I haven't done it so this feels like very monumental and literally just as I was finishing up my air fryer it's actually more than an air fryer it's like a ninja foodie but anyways it beeped for dinner so we're done 
we're done we're done also side note this is hilarious i was finishing in there and all of a sudden i saw a huge flash of light and i was like but it was like we have so many windows in here and there was this huge flash of light and i was like it was like purple and bright white i was like am i having a stroke <laughs> Am I like about like about to have a seizure or something? I don't know. I just wasn't expecting it to be what it was. Which was a thunderstorm. Because next thing I know, there was a huge crash of thunder. My chicken looks good and also questionable if that's possible. Well, I'm just gonna put a little more barbecue sauce on it while I heat up my sides. Anyways, I was not expecting this huge flash of thunder. I called my mom. I was like, Mom, I'm scared. She's like, Oh, I'm so sorry you're scared. It really frightened me. I'm alone. Like, it was got me. <sighs> Anyways, I'm gonna eat dinner now. I'm done. <laughs> Friday um, husband is currently out getting groceries the, the grocery order we put in and I am doing client work at the moment and when I say I'm doing client work I run a Pinterest account for a beauty salon a local beauty salon so like I bring in money that way um, and then I've also been approached to do like a website design that is like not at all <laughs> like the end goal here at all, but it helps while I'm like transitioning and rebranding myself, just like work I can do relatively easily for myself um, to bring in just like some extra income. So I have been approached about that. So I have to work on that tomorrow and it's tomorrow is Saturday and I am working tomorrow. I don't want to, but I didn't really do anything on Wednesday and don't want to get too far behind on tasks. Oh, I've got a like, pretty much a full I slated like basically a full work day for myself I'm just gonna try and be very effective and efficient and do like my main tasks for the day and be done hopefully before like five o'clock that's the goal and like even today I have like my goals set for the day I'm just gonna try and like get them done but I also, I have a, I had a meeting that was supposed to be this afternoon, like literally right now, but it got moved to this evening and I've been up since four. So I'm really hoping I'm uh, awake enough when this meeting takes place. Just like, that's late for me. That's late. It's like between, anytime between seven and nine-ish, I'm like, Y'all, I can't do that. <laughs> Usually I'm pretty good about, first of all, no meetings on Fridays and Mondays and definitely no evening meetings. So I'm breaking like two of my three main rules for this. Yeah. So, happy Friday. <laughs> happy Saturday from the couch. I am editing this vlog while I'm also filming this wrap-up portion of the vlog. But I have a couple like end of the vlog thoughts that I'm going to share. Um, I was working on like I have my goals for the day and one of the goals was to like finish planning out the Q1 YouTube slash blog content. Got the YouTube part done, still need to kind of flush out the blog part of that. Um, because I'm gonna launch. I'm gonna relaunch my website in probably about a month. I have to work on it But while I was doing that I was like thinking and I was like, you know I'm really trying to like find the way to like weave in my mediumship my psychic mediumship into this content I think that's going to be mostly through vlogs more style format content um and the reason I was thinking about that was because a week ago we, my husband and I went to an estate sale and I um, 
like obviously was like walking through the house with the person who was having the estate sale and I walked into the one one room and I was like um did the owner of this house pass away in this room and they had and I was like there's another spirit here and they're here too and they had passed away in the same room so I had that experience and it was the first time in a long time where I really felt like I missed doing readings and I really I haven't done many um over a year really I mean, there's been like sporadic ones like for friends and um like more urgent cases but I, I really I have not been doing readings I'm taking readings or clients and I have been like going back and forth with it and about it and like how I wanted to go about it and I've been thinking about it all week um and this morning when I, while I was working on planning content and like how I'm going to talk about it etc I was like I think it's time to start taking clients again I plan on taking clients for like coaching like life coaching and like legacy coaching and stuff and like I'm formulate, formulating how I'm gonna do that but I think in terms of like mediumship or like maybe some kind of like mediumship coaching um would be interesting so yeah that had me really thinking but definitely like one-on-one -on -one client work or walkthroughs or things like that I think I'm ready to do it again um with my grandma passing away and then my dad passing away I hadn't really felt in a place to do it but that was the first time in a while I was like yeah I think it's time to start doing that work again I do have a dream I have a dream and I'm going to share it and then we can come back and reference it after it happens I really want to be like a like on like discovery plus <laughs> um like on kindred spirits as a like as a psychic medium they bring in i know they work with chip coffee but it'd be really cool to like in that form or like destination fear or the ghost brothers are like literally my favorite um one of those shows to be like a psychic medium that they bring on um it would be awesome to do that and it would just I mean it goes hand in hand with what the work I'm trying to do which is like destigmatize death and the afterlife and our soul's power and etc but yeah so it was the first uh, I'm just ex excited to be feeling like I want to do that work again um yeah anyways I'm gonna edit this vlog and I will see you all in the next one Stay blessed, babes.